Good morning, good morning. I've taken over the vlog. <laughs> good morning. <sighs> we just finished exercising. And um, I let the boys sleep in today, but today will be school. There is an audition, self-tape audition for Ethan. Um, Julian has a feature film to read <laughs> because we have the script for that for the one that he's called back for. The other one that he's called back for. Yikes. Yeah, he's gotten called back for two feature films. Um, so things are popping. That's what I just told Horatio. <laughs> things are popping. Um, so yeah, today is just going to be stuff here probably. I'm sure something will come up because things always come up. Show this room over there? Oh, what? <laughs> wow, I didn't. I looked at this a while ago, but I just like said, I guess I could get it later. I never really looked on how shiny his hand was. Surprise! We are going to take a walk. It is, yes, you can see mom has her hat on because it is not, um, <laughs> it is not very spring-like. But it's opening day for baseball, so. <laughs> I'm glad I'm not at a baseball Wearing game. Wearing my Cubs shirt <laughs> under my insulated coat. <laughs> I know how scary it might. What is it? So I'm, so I'm super, right? And why did it say a little bit? So, so, and something. I beat. So I'm super aware. You're super aware. Super aware. And Trina. Wait. I know where the sub gets it right. That doesn't make sense. <laughs> I know where this. I just got off the phone with our friend Jordan. Our friend Jordan? Yes. Oh, you're, you're vlogging right now. I am. I'm vlogging right now. I'm so hello. excited. Yes. Hello. Hello. So. She is going to be in our area. <laughs> Julian's like, <laughs> sleep over with Jordan. <laughs> sleep over with Jordan. <laughs> yeah, um, she's going to be in our area. Maybe in, we can hear some more stories. <laughs> I know. And so we are uh, in cahoots with each other, trying to figure out how everything can work. And she was suggesting that she find a she find an Airbnb somewhere, and I'm like, Excuse me? No! No! Here, you're staying here, <laughs> girly. So, um. We know you watch these. <laughs> and, and so I'm very excited about that. But before I do anything further, I have to send an email to the production people for Gabriel's film and see if you are getting the uh memorial day off i know that you don't work on the weekends but i have to see if you're taking if they're taking a holiday on the holiday because it will help us to figure everything out ethan and i are heading into a store so we've been as we were riding up here we've been discussing confirmation and uh, they have to like figure out a statement of faith. Is that what it's called? Yeah. So we've been talking about that and he has a very good start, I think. I'm... <laughs> so what is on my nose? I don't know what that is. It doesn't feel like a pimple. It looks like one. Anyway, um, I, yeah, I don't know what it is. It's, it's flat. Just, it's just a... <laughs> it's a red mark, but, um, while I was in the store, I checked my email. There were some emails that were, there was one that was really nice. I won't talk about that one, but I, 
I entered the Broadway in Chicago ticket lottery today for the very first time. And I entered for all three shows because I want to see all of them. And I have some time right now before, you know, Easter where I don't really have major commitments, you know. So uh, I entered for the very first time and I won <laughs> for it's tomorrow. It's not a full win though, you still have to pay for it. I got two tickets, $25 each. That That's a huge win. So um, I'm gonna, I have two tickets for um, the play that goes wrong. And I have been wanting to see that play ever since I heard about it. And I can't wait to see it. And now I have to figure out who I'm gonna take with me. <laughs> Hello, um, I'm driving to choir practice, church choir practice. I had it all planned out where I was gonna tell you this really fun, cute story from yesterday. And then my phone rang and it was the doctor's office where we um, have been, uh, where we went to get Julian um, evaluated. Tomorrow is supposed to be the day that he, that we get, we find out about him, you know, like the results or whatever. And they called like three hours ago and they were confirming the appointment. And I said, yes, we are coming, it's on the calendar. And she just called right as I got into the van to leave for choir and said that there's an emergency and the doctor can't be there. Uh, and could you reschedule for Saturday morning at 10.30? So, I said, can I call you back? because I need to talk to my husband because he took the day off so he could do this tomorrow. <laughs> I know it's not your fault. You know, I just, I'm just, you know, I'm disappointed about that. And I feel bad. I hope that it's not a bad emergency. I hope everything's okay, but with the doctor. Um, but I had committed to teaching voice lessons up Maywood Fine Arts on Saturday because they need someone to fill in and I don't want to let people down but Julian wants to know what <laughs> I'm struggling to choir and look who I've just picked up from Hello. practice it is I, Dickon. It oh, is. there is motion at your front door. Oh my gosh, yeah. The ring doorbell just told me there's motion at my front door. I had no idea. Final clip. <laughs> um, I never got to tell you the funny story, the cute story that I was going to tell. So that is going to wait. Um... So, let's see. Tomorrow we have um, I'm going to see a show. <laughs> Basically. So we've got school. And yeah. Horatio still has the day off. Right? You're still taking the day off? Yeah. Okay. And um he might do something fun with the boys. We'll see. I'm not sure. But I am very anxious to go see this play. Are you anxious to see your friend? I, oh my gosh. I'm really anxious to see my friend. I'm thrilled. I am super excited that I get to hang out. And it's so spontaneous. But sometimes those are the best outings. So until tomorrow.